Lauren Weedman is one of the funniest people I know. An award-winning comedic actress, Lauren made her mark in TV with The Daily Show, Looking, Arrested Development, and more recently, Abbott Elementary and Hacks. But Lauren began her career in theater, writing and performing hilarious and brutally honest one-woman shows, and she's returning to her theatrical roots with the world premiere of Blows. Here's Lauren with the lowdown. What is Blows about? Blows is about my life, generally um, and specifically. I was trying to write this musical. It started about four years ago about bankruptcy. <laughs> it felt like there's not enough um, musicals about bankruptcy. And when you see that hole, you run to fill it. And so I was starting to write that. And then in the last four years, it's been completely impossible to finish anything um, because of just this constant survival mode I'm in and the single mother's survival mode. And anytime I even start to get creative, I might, if my son has any needs at all, like, oh, I'm choking or, you know, oh, feed me. I'm like, oh, there go my dreams again. So I, it's taken me a long time to try to finish this musical. So this is another attempt at trying to finish it. Why is it called Blows? It's called Blows? Oh God, how awful. That sounds kind of, that sounds gross. Um, it's called Blows because of um, this line in this uh, movie, Blue Jasmine, where uh, Kate Blanchett's character who's losing it is like, how many blows can a woman take before she starts screaming in the street? When I heard it in the movie, I started um, clapping and I didn't realize I was clapping. Like it's so, I was like, how many blows can a woman take before she starts screaming? Yes, that's exactly how I, so, and then, you know, I was I like a one word title. And they were like, oh, blows, how fun. It, it says all sorts of things. Is Blows a workshop production or a polished, finished show? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, you know, I've had some polished, finished shows. I was like polished and finished. <laughs> uh, no, I. Um, it's it's a workshop seems too loose and polished seems too tiny. It's a little of both because it's going to be some stuff that is uh, material I've been working on that is rehearsed. And, but I also want to try out new stuff. It's always a process, right? With like with the live performance, that's like another added step to getting the show where I want it to get is the audience reaction. Is Blows based on true stories from your own life? Yes. Blows is 100% based on true stories from my, my own life, completely. In fact, it, I say that and then I realize there's one, there's one part of the show where I did research. I live in Santa Monica and that's a part of the show. And I looked up to see who Santa Monica was and you know what the, what the city was founded on, that kind of stuff. That's that's the only part that's not completely about me. And I think that part's getting cut out of the show because I got bored even trying to tell you about it. Blows is a one woman show and yet there are other people on stage with you. What's with that? Totally. They're, they're very small people, I hope. Um, what is with that? Uh, there's a band. I'm playing with this guy, Tim Young, and he is a Seattle person who that now works with the Reggie Watts band on, the, on this Late Late Show. And he's helping me with the music. So they're gonna be on stage with me, which is great. You're premiering Blows on the stage of the Triple Door. Where do you hope Blows is gonna go? Broadway. I do hope that. I hope that we can do a little tour, get out and just go, you know, I, I would love to just tour a bit, you know, for a year or so. And then it'd be great to do, to sort of take that show and develop, get the, take the information, whatever I've learned from performing and go back, re-rehearse it, and then just uh, put it in a more sort of staged, sort of classic solo theater show. I'd love to do that and do a short run of that. And then turn it into a big comedy special. And then all these women over 50 will start wanting to get into solo theater and be stand-up comics and stuff. So get ready for that nightmare. Catch Blows at the Triple Door, February 25th and 26th, Saturday and Sunday. Two shows a night at 5 and 9. Ticket information is at thetripledoor.net.
catch Art Zone Friday nights at 8 and anytime online at seattlechannel.org slash artzone.